Taking a trip across Hong Kong Harbour is one of the most popular ways to get around for locals and tourists. Very fast to go to Wan Chai and you can see the harbour view. Very good. It's one of the most refreshing ways to get from the island over the Kowloon side and the way back again. It's also one of the cheapest forms of public transport. A one-way trip for an adult on the lower deck during the week costs just 25 cents. But that's set to increase by 30 per cent under a proposal by the company to raise more revenue to cover operational costs. If approved, that price hike will add an extra 8 cents to the fare. Our fare will stand for five years without any change. The latest change is only back in 2012. In a city of more than 7 million people, with heavy traffic and a crowded rail network, a small fare hike is unlikely to deter commuters. Every day, 50,000 people take the Star Ferry, about 20 million every year. That includes Chan Su Wing, the company's longest serving employee. The Victoria Harbour is too gorgeous. Hong Kong deserves its nickname of the Pearl of the Orient. I enjoy working on this scenic route. Chan Su Wing has spent more than half of his life at the helm of the Star Ferry. He started as a sailor. 33 years later, he's worked his way up the ranks to chief captain. Over that time, he's witnessed the harbour transform. There used to be dolphins in the harbour, but you don't see them anymore over the last 10 years. British submarines could also once enter the harbour. The size of Hong Kong's harbour has changed dramatically since the Star Ferry began its operations 120 years ago. Around 60 square kilometres of land has been reclaimed to build residential buildings, offices, hotels and a ferry terminal. Now that's had a direct impact on the duration and the route of the cross-harbour ride. In the old days, the sailing time between the ferry is from 20 minutes down and only up to 5 minutes now. You see, it's a big changes because of the reclamations. With the number of cars in Hong Kong continuing to rise, the city's Star Ferry is still one of the most convenient ways to travel in the territory. Sarah Clark, Al Jazeera, Hong Kong.